looks like our opponent has a Lorien set up with a Claymore and a Shield of Want. Pretty good shield, I dare say. Into the Follower Javelin. You don't see that very often, but when you do, it's always entertaining. Nailed him with the crossbow there. Nailed him with Dory's gnawing. Got the bleed on a running R1. And that is how you win with the reinforced club. Gunder's Halberd. That is going to be one tough cookie to eat. Get it? Because his name's Tough Cookie? Huh? Pretty good if I do say so myself. We actually outsped it. <laughs> That's surprising. I guess not really surprising. It is much shorter. Got the bleed and we banged him in the butt. I think our opponent has the Wolf Knight or the Black Knight Greatsword. A little hard to tell. Oh, man. <laughs> this little club. Just not long enough. Dory's, huh? Man, he still has not bled out. It's gotta be close, though. Oh my gosh, he has like one hit left. No! <laughs> That's the life of the Reinforced Club. Our opponent has obviously the Lothric Knight set up. The Lothric Knight Ultra Great Sword with a Lightning Infusion. Gonna have to be really cautious here. He can kill us very quickly. Well, we cannot. Oh my god! <laughs> what? Right after I say we cannot kill him very quickly. That was just luck. Our opponent has... Oh god, a Dark Moon Blade buff straight sword. I'm sure it'll be no match for the Reinforced Club. With a Bleed Infusion. Ooh, almost got me with that R2. Ouch, there's a parry. Hornet's Ring Repost. How lovely. <laughs> opponent has a Flaming Fume Ultra Great Sword. Just poisoning through all my attacks. Attack me while I'm bowing. All that lovely stuff. Wow, Dory's gnawing for the win? We deserve that. Our opponent has the Black Knight Greatsword. Kinda ruins the club fighting style with its trading hits and poise. Maybe we can rely a little bit more on the crossbow now. Man, that was close. One little splinter from that bolt. Man, I'm doing like no damage against this guy. What? He got me right before my uh, Dory's gnawing hit him. Got him with that R1. He was not expecting that, I don't think. Fairly close overall. Looks like our opponent has the Shield of Want. Hopefully he likes to use that thing, because I will bleed him to death by whacking on it. Hit him in midair, but he did quite a lot of damage. And we bled him out! 
Alrighty. Our opponent casts Sacred Oath, and they are using the Rose of Ariandel. Another weapon that actually does have bleed on it, and has the same exact moveset as a Reinforced Club. That might be an interesting Faith Bleed Strength build to go for. That was terrible timing. Wow, I actually hit him with it and rolled out of the way. There's the bleed, we have 690 damage. Pressure on with my crossbow. It's not really working. I'm just gonna go for the win here, get some extra physical damage. Oh man! I think our opponent has the that spear that casts sorcery is using faith as a modifier. You don't really see that very often. I did a video with it a while ago. Can't even remember the name of it. Golden Ritual Spear, that's what it is. How did I miss? Oh my god. Uh. Traded in kits with this Dark Edge. Hopefully I got some bleed. There's a bleed right there. Opponent has the Fair and Ultra Great Sword. Ever since that weapon got buffed, I've been seeing it quite a lot more. What I do not see very often is the Reinforced Club. Or Dory's Gnaw, which I just hit him with. Wow. Down to the wire here. <laughs> I got one hit left. He has about one hit left. One combo, I mean. Yeah, I think one combo would have killed him. Ah! Our opponent has a lightning buffed red hilted halberd. He's got that poise weapon art. We got the crossbow. I don't want to mess with him when he's got that poise buff going. When it's gone, though, <laughs> I will R1 spam him to death. Alright, Mr. Quakestone Hammer. Do you have the power to defend against the reinforced club? So far, the answer is yes. Uh, sometimes I, I think I should use the talismans to cast that, just so I can get some poise. opponent is very red. After we're through with him, he'll be very dead. Unless he kills us. And then we will be dead. Wow, a three-hit combo on Mr. Club. And the bleed off Dory's gnawing. It looks like he just cast 
Iron Flesh. Lucky me. I have to bleed with it again. Not a good time to cast Iron Flesh, I don't think. The Crucifix of the Mad King with Dark Blade. And <laughs> there's a deep protection. We're gonna have a hard time overcoming this, but we can do it with a little help from Bleed. Looks like he has... Probably the Saint's Talisman? Not sure, I was able to break his poise. Why is he not letting go? Ouch. That was weird. Ugh. Come on, club! We tried. Opponent has a claymore with Dark Moon Blade on it. it. Looks like there's some considerable lag as well. Oh my god, I can't believe I did that. It's like the best way the club can win. Just sit there and hit R1. Our opponent has the Murakumo. We have. The most deadly weapon in the, in the entire Dark Souls lineup, the Reinforced Club. Almost got him in the butt. Ouch. Yep. Opponent has a blessed weapon something. Is that a whip? A blessed whip. It's kind of cool, you don't really see... Whips with buffs very often. It's kind of like a lightsaber whip. These Darth Binks. Actually, it's a white whip, so he must be a good guy. Get back here, you! Oh, his uh, buff wore off. Broke the guard of his shield. Still have not gotten any bleed. But we got the win. Our opponent has Ornstein's helm. Looks like the Ring Knight Straight Sword and Black Knight Shield. Man, that was a close call. He got us with the R2 though. Couple R1s in. He gets four hits. And the win. Hello everyone, Moose Torrent here, and today I have another strength bleed build for you. This one a little less effective. He uses the reinforced club, which is not the best weapon out there. It's short, it's slow, the attack speed is fairly slow, so you're not going to be building up a ton of bleed with it. But with the bleed infusion, it does get 70 bleed buildup, which is not bad. I get a B scaling and strength with 40, I'm getting 304 attack power. I also have 40 luck to boost that bleed buildup, which is why it's at 70. And I have 25 faith so I can use the Saint Tree Belvine to cast Dory's Gnawing. Though, if you want to take it to a 120 build, 130 build, just take out the points into faith and get rid of Dory's Gnawing. You'll be fine. You can still use a light crossbow with splintering bolts, Northern Helm, Exile Armor, Gauntlets, and Gunder's Leggings with the Ring of Favor, Clorinthy, Life, and the Wolf Ring. Let's get started with the Reinforced Clubbing. This is Moose Torrent, and I'll be back with another video for you guys shortly.